Welcome to All-in-One SEO. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set the SEO for your homepage. There are two different kinds of homepages in WordPress, so let's head over to the Settings menu on the left first and go ahead and click on the link that says Reading. So the first section here says your homepage displays your latest post or a static page. So I'm going to show you both ways. We'll show you how to do this with your homepage set to display your latest post first. We're going to head on over to the All-in-One SEO menu and click on the link that says Search Appearance. And on the main page that pops up, the Global Settings tab, if we scroll down about halfway down that page, we get to the Homepage Settings. So this is where you control the SEO for your homepage if you have your homepage set up to display your latest post. So the first section here is a preview. This is how your listing will look on Google. And then below that, we have the site title and the meta descriptions. We can use any of these smart tags that are available here. Right now, I have site title, separator, and tagline. So we can see that it says demo site. The separator is this little vertical bar here. And then site for SEO demo. So let's say I want to just type in something instead of having site title. I'm going to type in my web page. And then instead of the separator, I want to put in an emoji. So I'm going to put in this little happy emoji here. I'm going to put a space before him, and then I'm going to leave the smart tag for the tagline, which is pulling in site for SEO demo. And then the meta description works the same way. So right now it's just pulling in the tagline. I could use any of these smart tags here. If you want to view all tags, you click the view all tags link, or you can also just type in a hashtag symbol here, and you'll get the list of all the tags that you could use. You can also just type in your own custom description. So I'm going to type in my own custom description. And then if I scroll back up to the preview area, we can see how that will appear in the search results with my title and my description. When you're all done making those changes, scroll down to the bottom of the page or all the way back up to the top and click the big blue button that says Save Changes. So that's how you control your SEO for your homepage when your WordPress website displays your latest post on your homepage. So now I want to show you how to control the SEO for your homepage if you have WordPress set up to use a static page for your homepage. So let's head back on over to that WordPress settings section and click on reading again. So here back on this setting, let's say that we are, instead of using the latest post on this site, we're going to use a static page. And the page I'm going to use is home. I'm going to click the big blue button that says save changes. And then to control the SEO for this page, we're actually going to go to that page. So go to the pages section in your WordPress dashboard. And I'm just going to scroll down and look for that page called home, which is right here. So then you scroll down below the content of your page until you get here to the all-in-one SEO settings section. And then this is very similar to what we just saw before. You have a preview section. You have a place where you can control the page title and a place where you can control the meta description. So I'm going to leave in site title. I'm going to go ahead and add a separator, a little checkmark emoji, another separator. And then I'm just going to add in the best site. Below that, we have the meta description. Right now, it's using this smart tag of page content. So that is pulling in literally the content of the page, which is just this is the home page. Now, if you had a normal page with a lot of content, the page content smart tag would probably be way too much for your meta description. So I'm going to remove that. And then we can click the view all tags link here or just type in a hashtag. And you can get all of the smart tags that are available. I'm going to go ahead and use the tagline here. So if we scroll back up, we can see that it has put in site for SEO demo, which is my tagline. This is how you would control the SEO for your homepage on your homepage if you have WordPress set up to use a specific page. When you're all done, go ahead and click the blue update button and your homepage SEO has been set up. If you have any other questions, go ahead and check out our documentation at aioseo.com slash docs. If you don't find the answer to your question there, feel free to open a support ticket and we'll be happy to help you out.